All right, ladies and gentlemen, walked in on Seeger having a little lesson here. Really happy with the way this guy's ear crop is going along here. As far as the rest of his development, really, really happy with that as well. Talking one-on-one -on -one with his puppy raiser, she said, this guy, and I quote, is a absolute joy to be around. Very willing to please dog. Looks to the handler naturally for direction and some sort of validation. And you can see we've used that to just increase the obedience that we've been working with here. Very beautiful ear crop. Very happy with the way it turned out. Still supporting it, still bracing in as necessary. But you guys can see here, we're letting them, you know, take a little break from the bracing, letting some air get there, keeping everything nice and clean. Yep. That's good. You can see that leash got around him, but he didn't care. Didn't care one bit. Up on these slippery tables. Not concerned about that. And these tables are great for their coordination, keeping these guys from getting sloppy. We don't want them to be sloppy jointed or lazy footed. We want them to be nice, tight footed, paying attention to where their body's at, paying attention to where everything else, you know, in relevation to their hind end and front end are. You can see him having to navigate that slippery corner a little bit. That's good for him. Very good. Bear's mentioning we've got another lesson going on in here. A lot of other distractions. And these are just some of the normal things we do here in protection dog sales. Set us out from the rest. We work under distractions and we're constantly, constantly pushing those environmental. So here's Seeger. He knows I'm talking about him. <laughs> 